her first reaction to it, she said to me, it's so thin, it's so thin. She looked at it and she said, I'm just so used to seeing pamphlets because it is thicker. And she said, it's so thin, I'm afraid it's going to leak. And I said to her, no, don't let the size of it, that's hella absorbent, don't let that size throw you off. <laughs> don't let that size throw you off, right? <laughs> All right, guys, let's talk about that feeling of success when you help a fellow parent out, that feeling of victory and success. All right, so let me just jump into this. I feel really excited because my younger sister, she finally went ahead and gave Love's, <laughs> Love's diapers a try. You know, I've been trying to convert her forever and ever, telling her how much I love Love's. All right, so what I love about Love's is that it's really, it's hella absorbent but it's also budget friendly and I am a cheap old parent. I'm pretty cheap, I'm as cheap as it's gonna get. All right, let me give you the skinny on her. She's been using Pampas forever. Like my niece is 10 months old and she's been going ahead and spending a boatload of cash on Pampas diapers. And finally, you know, she was in the store and I said, just go ahead, sis, just go ahead, give it a try and let me know what you think. Before I even go any further in this video, just to let you know if you're considering, you know, between Loves and Pampas, they are manufactured by the same company. It's manufactured by Procter & Gamble. So just to let you know, I'm gonna say that Loves is for the parents who wanna conserve a little bit on cash and Pampas is for parents who don't mind spending the additional money. <laughs> That's gonna be my difference on the two of them. But anyways, back to her story. Her first, her first reaction to it, she said to me, it's so thin, it's so thin. She looked at it and she said, I'm just so used to seeing Pampas because it is thicker. And she said, it's so thin, I'm afraid it's going to leak. And I said to her, no, don't let the size of it. That's hella absorbent. Don't let that size throw you off. <laughs> Don't let that size throw you off, right? <laughs> so I said to her, don't let the size of it and the thinness of it throw you off. I said to her, just do me a favor. Go ahead and put baby girl in that diaper overnight and let me know in the morning. Give me a call in the morning telling me what you think about it. And let me tell you her reaction. She said to me, and I'm going to quote, I am so surprised. I am so surprised. This thing did not leak. Uh, her daughter, my niece wore it overnight. It did not leak. I wish I can show you all how the diaper looked, but obviously I'm not going to go there. You're going to have to take my word on it. It did not leak. She had a dry bed and a happy baby. The differences between them for her was that with Pampas, Pampas did a better job at masking the odor overnight because in the mornings when she would wake her baby girl up, she would not smell anything or not much. And she said with the loves, when she picked her baby girl up, she was able to smell more of an odor from it. For me, I didn't have that experience with my daughter, um, or maybe I didn't pay attention to it that much. But once again, my daughter was using loves from the time she was four weeks. And maybe that's why I didn't notice it. All right, guys, look, I just wanted to pop in and share her thoughts on loves, especially being a brand new parent. You know, you want to do what's right for your kiddos. And she really wanted to stick with Pampers. But I said to her, look, just go ahead and give Loves a try. You know, Pampers and Loves, they're manufactured by the exact same company, which is Procter & Gamble. So it's a win-win all around. It's just the fact being that Loves is a fraction of the cost. And of course, Pampers is the premium. But overall, it's going to do, Loves is going to do the trick, all right? If you're new here, subscribe, turn on the notifications, and I will see you on my next video.